Okay, so welcome to Math Storia and let's solve this problem. So to solve for this integral, we're going to use the integral by substitution. And for this given, we let u equals to the function with radical. So u is equal to square root of x. Then to omit this radical, so we need to take the square both sides. So we have u squared is equal to x. Then find the derivative of this equation. So we have the derivative of u squared is equal to the derivative of x. Since the derivative of x squared is equal to 2x times the dx, so therefore the derivative of u squared is equal to 2u times the du, then equals dx. So this time we can solve now the integral of this given using substitution. So from the given we have this the integral of dx and dx is equal to 2u du. So we have 2u times the du over 1 plus the square root of x and square root of x is equal to u. Then put this constant outside so we have 2 times the integral of u du over 1 plus u. Then to solve for this integral we need to rewrite this equation first. Since x is the same as x plus 1, then minus 1 because 1 minus 1 does 0. So therefore, this u is the same as u plus 1, then minus 1 over 1 plus u, then the du. So this time we can integrate this one separately. So we have 2 times the integral of this group. That's u plus 1 over the denominator. That's 1 plus u. Then the du minus the integral of 1 over the denominator. That's 1 plus u times the du then simplify so we have 2 times the integral of this u plus 1 and 1 plus u this one is equal to 1 then the du minus the integral of 1 over 1 plus u du so to solve now for the integral of this equation so we have 2 times the integral of 1 du since the integral of dx is equal to x. So therefore the integral of 1 du that's equal to u. Then minus so this integral of 1 over 1 plus u since the integral of 1 over x plus 1 is equal to ln. Then the absolute value of x plus 1. So therefore, this integral of 1 over 1 plus u is equal to ln. Then the absolute value of 1 plus u. Then plus c. Then distribute this 2 to every term. So we have 2u minus then ln the absolute value of 1 plus u plus c. So this time we can substitute now the value of u and u is equal to square root of x. So therefore we have 2 times the square root of x minus 2 then ln the absolute value of 1 plus u and u is equal to square root of x then plus c. So this one is the final answer.